What's up guys? So today I've got a pretty big opening. We're going to be opening up 250 of each of the new chests. So these are, they're not necessarily entirely new, but they've been completely reworked and they have um, mostly different drops. So uh, this first one is called consumables. The second one is skilling. So obviously food and potions in this one and skilling supplies in this one. We've got armor in this one, uh, weapons in this one, accessories, which is like rings, um, amulets, uh, other items. <laughs> We'll, we'll, we'll see when we open them, but yeah. Uh, and then this one is cash, pretty much just all cash, cash-related items. And then Magic Chest is all six of these, just the very rare tables. So just the very rare mahogany, the very rare teak, the very rare oak. Um, so you could get a thousand raw sharks, you could get, like, rapier or whatever is on the, you know, the other tables or whatever. So. Uh, so without further ado, let's get them open. We'll start off with consumables. Let's open up 250 consumables. This is going to be a long video, so get comfortable. Well, actually, it might not be a long video because I'm the one opening them and I'll just be pausing and resuming. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, so just opening up the last few here. And, yeah, so obviously this is not going to be a massive big deal for most accounts. Um, probably just Ironman would want this one, but, you know, this is what the loot looks like. You get tons of food, tons of potions, stuff like that. Um, yeah. All right, let's move on to skilling. Okay, so there is an issue with this one where you, um, whenever you get the lava bone drop, it puts them all on the floor, and they're supposed to be noted, but they're not noted, so that'll be fixed. And then the last ones, so, yep. Last skin supplies. These golden spears, if you're wondering, this is from the Hunter Boss Tuz. And, uh, so count how many that is, and that's how many times we got the dragon bone drops. Everything else is pretty straightforward. These wooden shelves are relatively new. Um, it's just five bookcases. These just give XP. I guess I could have made it give you five with opened, so you don't have to do that. But uh, yeah, <laughs> uh, pretty straightforward, pretty simple. If you're wondering what the file looks like, this is basically how it is for uh, all of them. So you just have your um, it's 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 repeated, but the amounts are higher based on what tier tier of rarity you hit. So. Uh, for the low tier ones, they're not, uh, like I said, they're very niche. They have, mainly I would think Ironman would be, uh, we get them. But, yeah, let's move on to the armor and weapons. Some actually decent stuff in here. Alright, we got the last bit here. I guess I just kind of saw a spoiler there, but whatever. So, yeah, you do get the full armor sets, not just the Carol's armor specifically, or, you know, like the actual armor. Is there, there's, oh, <laughs> duh, I was going to say, I was like, what am I missing? Uh, so we only got one BCP. I don't, is that, let me, let me go put the file over quick. Yeah, so we did not hit the very rare table. The odds of hitting the table are 1 in 256, so, um, yeah, the Ancestral and Obsidian is on that table. And then Bando's Boots, or Bando's and Armadale, that's on the rare table. So we, we got a lot of that, just only one, I wonder why. I guess it's purely just a coincidence, but... Yeah, and then on the low tier table, you do have some Guthics and just normal Void pieces and stuff like that. It's mostly armor. The only time you actually do get a weapon is from these. So, yeah, let's move on to the weapons and see those. Last lot here. So, yeah, you can see it's weapons. You do have some low tier stuff, tier 70 stuff like the whip, the crossbow, and even lower with that. A lot of Avandis has returned. So, yeah, you can get a lot better stuff from this one just because it seems like there's more weapons available than armor pieces, but yeah, we did uh, we did get a good chunk of stuff, Dragon Claws, Grant Warhammer, Eldemol, uh, we did get Kodai, yeah, so a lot better stuff on this end, you do get some lower end stuff still, but uh, yeah, you can kind of see what I'm going for with these new items, and if you have any suggestions, like for anything, you can post below, you can post on the Discord, anything like that, but uh, yeah, this is 250, so let's go on to the accessory one. Last inventory... Very shiny, very shiny. So yeah, accessories. <laughs> you can get uh, like primordials, you can get anguish, torture, you can get some of the lower tier ones. Speeds of the dead are pretty good. This is from Vorkath. And then um, the base rings are at least imbued, so there's that. You can get the, and but you can also find chronicle and zombie head, so if you never got those, this is kind of a way to get them. But uh, yeah, looting bag, ring pouch, accessories, right? <laughs> you get it. Okay, so kind of issue with this, we're going to actually have to turn all of the coins into platinum tokens. That's going to make it kind of weird, but let me just show you what the file looks like. So you have a small cash bag, a medium cash bag, you have one mil, uh, 100 mil, 
and then you have 100 mil in tokens. So the same exact amount, but I just kind of split it up. And then you sort of have it repeating here, and then you have large cash bag is a very rare, and then maxing out. So that's kind of what it's going to look like. I'm going to have to turn all of the coins into tokens just to make it work. All right, so this is the loot from 250. Uh, so I just want to show you the cash bags first. We did hit two large cash bags. I have no clue if we hit the platinums or not. Uh, we'll open it all up and then we'll see what it is now. So 14 mil, and then that much cash. We'll uh, I'll open a visa real quick. So we ended up getting 71 mil and 121 mil from the large ones. That's pretty bad because they're up to one bill. It's one GP to one bill. Uh, wow. But uh, yeah, that'll be the uh, that really no okay. Dear. But yeah, that's about how much money you could expect from a nice uh, 250. Let's move on to the magic chests. All right, so we did get four sets of Lava Dragon Bones. We know that those ones are each 1,000 apiece, but this is what it looks like. So we got some cash, we got some platinum tokens, some, we did get some, uh, we, yeah, we got full set of Obsidian, full sets of Ancestral, we did get the zombie heads. That We'll do these four in a sec, just to see. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, you, you just hit the very rare table, so it could be good, you could get some of this nice stuff, or you could get Golden Spears, Angler, you know, there's a, there is a lot of, of stuff to actually balance it out, so. Yeah, let me know your guys' thoughts on these, the whole point was just kind of try to like, you know, they weren't they weren't great as they were, they really weren't. They Most people just sold them for the, the value that they had, no one really ever wanted them. Um, and this is kind of the original, When if you ever played the server when it first came out, they were sort of all different. They all had different items, none of them had the same items at all. Um, and so that's kind of what I went for with this. It's a little a little different, but yeah, I, I like it. Let's see what's in these. You can't get, you can never get nothing from these. I swear it's up to one bill, not 500 mil. I think. <laughs> I think. I'm dumb. It's up to 500 mil. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Peace.